<laughs> Greetings from the Olympic Peninsula. Greg and I are in the Olympic National Forest, just outside of Olympic National Park. And we are about to head out on a four day, three night backpacking trip to the Marmot Pass area. When we arrived at 8.50 a.m. on this Sunday morning, there were about 50 cars here. So we're expecting to see quite a few people up there. We've gone about 1.8 miles and we're taking a break this little unnamed creek and waterfall. Well, we finally made it to Boulder Camp, eight hours after leaving the trailhead. There are four other tents pitched here and there's actually not that many places to put a tent. So we kind of found an ad hoc spot to make camp for the night. So here's what we did today. We started at this trailhead and hiked up, up, up the Big Quilcene River all the way to Marmot Pass. And then from Marmot Pass, we came down here to Boulder Camp, which is where we're camped tonight. Good morning. It is day two here in the Buckhorn Wilderness. We slept well last night, but there was a heavy dew overnight, so our tent is pretty saturated. Because this camp is down in a bowl, it took a really long time for the sun to hit things here this morning. So we are camped here at Boulder Camp, and today we're gonna do a day hike up here to Home Lake and Constance Pass.
After three and a half miles, we made it to Home Lake. Today is day three. We've spent the last two nights camped here at Boulder Camp. We're going to pack up this morning and hike to Marmot Pass, where we will stash our overnight packs and then hike up to Buckhorn Mountain. Then we'll get our packs and come down and spend the night at Camp Mystery. I've got my bag packed and ready to go. And while I wait for Greg to finish, I've got my Kindle. That's Buckhorn Mountain, which we are about to hike up. Well, we've reached Marmot Pass and we've stashed our overnight packs in the trees and switched to day packs. And now we're gonna hike up Buckhorn Mountain. We've been having afternoon clouds every day and because we didn't leave camp until 11 o'clock this morning, we did not beat the clouds up Buckhorn Mountain and the summit was socked in so we decided to turn around about halfway up.
Well, we managed the steep scramble trail up to Buckhorn Mountain, but we did not go the whole way because the summit was in clouds. So we picked a spot where we did have a view and spent more than two hours hanging out there and enjoying the beautiful mountains. Then we went back down to Marmot Pass, grabbed our packs, and came down here to Mystery Camp where we found a nice little campsite next to a spring. And now it's time for dinner. Today is the fourth and final day of our trip. We only have about four and a half miles to go and it's all downhill. Should be good. 